Building a custom bike starts exactly from choosing the right bike. You need something that's user friendly, has parts readily available and an extremely versatile chassis. Much like the 650 twins from Royal Enfield. In particular, the 650 Continental GT is very famous amongst enthusiasts to build project bikes. But not every canvas can be called art. This one, ladies and gentlemen, is an absolute masterpiece. Welcome to the Drivers Hub. My name is Bhavneet Baswani and this is the Ricochet Motorcycles Conti 650. So let's talk about the build and what all is different but first let's just take a step back and take it all in because my oh my am I weak in the knees. Let's start from the front. You get a new front visor with uh, these offset Hella projector uh, lamps. A very beefy Benelli 600 i forks with the spring cut off for the stunts. A billet custom clip on handlebar and 17 inch rims front and rear that are wrapped with Rosso Diablo Pirelli tires. Uh, you get fenders that are custom built and as far as I can see everything is blacked out from the exhaust, the entire exhaust system, the engine casing, the fuel cap. The rear also has been very cleanly built with a Himalayan tail light and this custom tail end which make the bike look super neo retro and completely timeless but the piece there as a stance is the paint job the body panels have been layered with a single weave of real carbon fiber and covered with a clear coat of lacquer so the weave is exposed and if you pay close attention you'll notice that all the weaves are aligned symmetrically all across the body from the front to the rear and not only is this attention to detail that's impressive the fact that the owner of the bike himself did it as a DIY project is what makes this paint job so damn cool. Swing your leg over the saddle and the first thing you notice is the seat. This diamond stitched seat is slightly wider in the rear which cups your bum really nicely and you've got these matching tank pads that hold the inner thigh really nicely too while riding. The clip-on handlebars sit slightly lower, a bit more committed than the stock ones but uh, they are not as bad as you'd expect them to be. To be honest, I'm actually quite excited to take it for a spin and see how the front fares. So let's do exactly that. In terms of mechanical upgrades, it's very straightforward with this 650. A DNA air filter for better intake and an exhaust to match that. This specific set of slip-ons are the roadrunners from a Thai workshop called Duskland Exhausts. And just listen to it. Powerful and intimidating. But on the fly, the case is very different. The new set of 17-inch rims combined with these grippy Diablo Rosso rubber give me tremendous amounts of grip and the Benelli upside down forks have made the bike feel like a completely different animal. All of the weight is still felt but the bike feels so much more eager to tip into a corner. The bike feels much more lively in the top end coming out of the corner too. It's weird to describe it like this but imagine if a Continental GT went to the gym but forgot to manage their diet. Yes, you can see the improvement, but it's all under that unwanted weight. But hey, that's not a problem with the mods or the build. That's just how the Conti 650 is. But yet, it's always been a bike that oozes character and Ricochet Motorcycles has definitely brought the level of charisma two notches above. When it comes to what it costs to build something like this, the news is rather grim. You see, Mr. Srini, the owner of the bike, didn't want to spend absurd amounts of money and all the mods are rather sensible. But the cost of trial and error in order to give it the magic it has now, that's where you break the bank. 
Moreover, fabrication and machining costs a lot more than you would expect. The owner told us that overall, he's paid as much money as the bike costs on building it. Yup, this is around three and a half lakh rupees of work on the bike. What you're paying for is loads of hours of labor, a manufacturer like finish and attention to detail like no other. What makes this project so special is that Ricochet motorcycles have managed to make the bike look like beauty that won't be changed by the times. Truly a timeless build. And that ladies and gentlemen is what creates art. Do let us know what are your thoughts on the build in the comment down below and if you were to build your own project bike what would you choose as your canvas? And if you enjoyed the vid, it would mean the world to us if you'd give it a like. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Bhavneet. See you in the next one.